Hey everyone, my name is Hans. I'm the head of growth for Wiza.co and in today's video I want to show you a quick tip on how to send call emails at scale but personalize them at the same time uh, using custom variables. Now, these custom variables, they're available in almost any email sender out there. But for today's example, we're going to start using Wiza Connect. Wizza Connect is a new feature that we've recently launched uh, with Wizza, and I'm really excited to show it to you guys. So let's get started. So here we are with uh, a data sheet that we'll be using, uh, much like any CSV that you can get through uh, through Wizza Prospect or whichever tool you're using to get your um, your data. Now, this is what it looks like. You have your company, your location, uh, other information that we provide, but this part is important where you add an extra um, extra column with a first line. Now, what you would do is um, you want to, of course, start sending emails that are personalized so you get a better reply rate and just in general, it's it's better practice. But to do them one by one would be uh, nearly impossible. So what you would do, you just take a file like this and... Um, instead of just these three uh, contacts in here, you could maybe even have 300 and either you or someone on your team or a VA could go through them and just add like a personal line um, saying, hey, I love your content at Wizza. Um, hey, did you know this? Hey, I couldn't help us but help but know if we went to the same university or that you um, got this round of funding, anything that is custom. Um, and you just add it in there as a first line. Now, not all tools allow you to add like an extra line in there. So what um, a workaround is that you could use, for example, if you're saying, listen, um, I'm not going to be using this, like the location, or maybe in the tool that you've been using is different. Uh, I won't be using domain, but it does allow me to import domain. Just take out whatever uh, whatever is under here, and you swap that out with any any custom first line that you would like to use. Then the next step would be um, downloaded as a CSV. Once you've done that through Wizard Connect, you simply start a new campaign. Then we're going to go and upload that CSV that we just made. So the one um, I've named it Wizard Video for now. Then going to the next step. And one, then once you're here, once you've uploaded your CSV, what you can simply do is you can have your normal template uh, saying we work with so you have your normal template like you would usually use, but then you want this first line to be custom for um, for each and every email. Then one added benefit of that is you'll um, you'll see not only your open rates, but also your um, just your overall metrics start to improve because it's looking less spammy for um, for spam filters, which uh, which definitely helps in getting into the inbox. So here you see first line. So this will be the first line, the custom variable that we have in there. Again, if you're on a different different tool, then just use uh, company or whichever you replaced with that first line. Then what it looks like in a preview is then you have that custom first line for each and every contact that you're looking to, uh, looking to reach out to. Um, Wiza Connect is pretty straightforward. You just save and continue from here. Um, you'll set up, uh, you set up the full sequence and it takes care of all the sending for you. It's pretty easy. So after you've set that up, you can reach out to, uh, to a ton of people at scale with, um, with customized and personalized emails. So I hope that helped. So there you have it. That is how you can send call emails at scale with a personalized touch to it, preferably using Wiza Connect. If you like it, uh, make sure to drop a comment down there with hashtag cold email. So that way, um, first of all, I'll know that you liked it and you'll increase the reach so other people can pick up on it too and hopefully find it, uh, find it useful for them as well. For now, thank you for watching and until next time.